Alright, hey guys, Fiddle Ferret here, back to bring you yet another video, and today we're doing something a little bit different. We're going to be looking at, uh, I went to a con the other day, and uh, I had the absolute pleasure of getting to get some voice actor autographs, and get to meet them and chat with them for a bit, and so I just thought I'd take a moment to just showcase everything I got, and, um, and that kind of thing. So anyway guys, we're going to go ahead and start with a little bit of a lesser known voice actor. Uh, her name is Terry Doty and she, her by far her biggest role is uh, is Virgo from Fairy Tale, um, the Celestial Spirit. And she has some other roles she's done. I know she's got an upcoming role in Assassination Classroom and I believe she's got something as well in Tokyo Ghoul. And just little stuff like that. She's mostly little side characters. She pops in every now and then. So I bought this from her table. Uh, this is basically a card with probably obviously most of her uh, most well-known characters. And so this was pretty cool, I thought. And so this was like, I didn't really have much for her to sign. So I just kind of went with this because I thought this was definitely a good way to kind of get all of her characters in one. Usually the voice actors have pretty cool stuff for you to sign anyway. And so I also, um, I had Fairy Tale Volume 9, and as far as I know, this is, I didn't really look that extensively when I was going to the con, but this is the only one I know that like has Virgo on the cover. And so I was like, ah, oh, that works. And so I think, uh, yeah, she signed right here, uh, Terry Doty as Virgo. So she was really cool. It was definitely a pleasure to meet her. Um, she was really nice. Her and Monica seemed to uh, be getting along really well. And speaking of Monica, yes, I am talking about Monica Real. Uh, I cannot believe uh, Monica was at the con I went to. Uh, I, co I was so unbelievably excited, and I was able to get her to sign so many things. So we'll go ahead and just start with that. So as some of you may have seen, I'd like a spotlight video on my fairy tale volume here. Um, you can go ahead and go back and watch that if you would like. But uh, she signed right here. Obviously, as you can see, like so, and um, she, so she did, she voices Mira Jane and Plu, um, actually, so she has a couple, couple voices in there, but I'm hoping to get a bunch of fairy tale voice actors to um, sign this volume. I'm going to have to be careful with it, because the cover, I can see it getting dinged up, especially if I bring it around a lot, so... I'm hoping that someday I'll have like 15, you know, 10, 15, maybe even 20 signatures in that. That would be really cool someday. And so this is one of the um, cards I bought from her. I actually went through the line twice because I was first in line because I'm lame like that. <laughs> and uh, I was so early that I got my stuff signed so quickly I got back in line and got them to sign more. It was great. So, the lovely stocking anarchy, and she asked me when she went to sign this, she was like, uh, do you want it clean or dirty? And I was extremely confused, I was like, um, what are you, what are you asking me, Monica Real? And then it was like, oh, right, I was like, well, dirty, of course, so... She was like, yeah, some people um, look at me a little funny when I write repent motherfucker on uh, on their little cards. It's like, I could see that, I suppose. So this, this, these cards are really cool. They actually have um, her Twitter and her Facebook. And like, I think every character she's been and what show she's been in. So that's also really neat. So I got, well, this is one of the cards I bought from her. Um, as well as another one of the cards. I'm going to get this bad boy framed. Um, I got this beautiful picture. Monica is so pretty. She's so pretty. <laughs> um, much love to you. So this is uh, a really nice picture of her. And so I was like, oh, that's cool. I bought, I, had, I bought like three. It was like a deal if you bought at least three of them. And so I bought that because I was like, ah, that seems pretty cool. And so also, what else did I get Monica? I got Monica to sign a lot of stuff. I got super lucky. And so obviously she was Mira Jane. And so this is a volume that was obviously very appropriate for that. And so here we go. Monica Real is Mira Jane. And so there's that one. And then this is something I've talked about. If you've seen my, uh, my video for this for my Soul Eater uh, yearbook edition unboxing. I talked about how this is like the, it's, it's a yearbook. That's that's what it's supposed to emulate. So it's the absolute perfect thing to kit voice actors to sign. And so here we are, right here. I uh, got Monica to sign her, obviously her Subaki page. I wasn't really sure how I wanted to do it first. I didn't know if I just wanted them all on the inside. But I guess it makes sense that they can all sign their own character pages, which is really sweet. So, uh, so yeah, so I got her to sign this. Super excited. Uh, these two things are just two things that I'm hoping that over time I can start filling them up with the uh, voice actors I meet. Um, 
I got my, I didn't, I didn't have time to, uh, I didn't remember to actually take the slip cover out, so I just had him sign the box on the outside here. Um, I'm trying to remember what his name was. It was something Hoff. It might have been David, <laughs> David Hasselhoff. It was, it, I think it was something Hoff or something like that. I'm really sorry to the gentleman. Um, I forgot his name. I'll put it in the description if I can remember. But I believe he was one of the AR directors on Wolf Children. And so I thought that was pretty cool. Uh, I knew he was going to be there. Not many people had stuff for him to sign. And so I was like, you know what? I definitely got to bring something because you never want to be in a line with someone uh, signing stuff and then nobody has anything for you to sign. So I brought that uh, because that was one of the shows he had worked on. And now we're doing a bit of a split here. I have this here, which is really cool. I'm really happy I got both voice actors to sign this. Um, this is Monica Rial again, also signing this. And this is, as you know, obviously she voices Shiro in Dead Man Wonderland. And uh, she's, what, other, what else is Monica? She, Monica's in ever, absolutely everything. She's that voice actress that just pops up everywhere, pretty much. And like she was May. Um, from Fullmetal Alchemist, just so many little roles and quite a few big roles as well. And so Monica, I got Monica to sign this, as well as um, Greg Ayers, who voiced Ganta. And so I was super happy to get this signed, especially because the verse volume has them both on the cover, which is uh, a happy, you know, coincidence. So that was really cool to have boys. It's always cool to, if you have like a volume or something with multiple characters on it to get like multiple voice actor signatures. That's one of my favorite things to try to do. And so, so yeah, I got this. This is one of the things I wanted to get signed most because I knew they were both going to be there. Greg Ayers is such a cool guy. Uh, he's so chill. Uh, it was unbelievable how chill he was. I mean, it was it was unbelievable. Um, so Greg Ayers, what else does he be in? He hasn't had too many huge, huge roles, but I know he has a role coming up in Free, uh, come, I believe. So look forward to that. Um, so obviously he was also in way back when, uh, I didn't really care for the anime of Nejima, and there are lots of things of Nejima that annoys me, but still he was there, and I was like this would be a cool thing for him to sign, so I got him to sign this. So yeah guys, I think that just about wraps it up, except for one thing. So my friend is a huge fan of uh, Mira Jane from Fairy Tale, and so I knew Monica was gonna be there and so when I went back online the second time to get more stuff signed I was like you know I could be nice and get something for him I haven't told him that I've gotten him something and so there's a 50-50 chance he watches this video I make fun of him because he never watches my videos and so we'll see Zach if Zach watches this video he successfully spoiled his Christmas present if not I hid it from him in plain sight and I will be able to mock him later I will let you guys know uh, later if um, how that went but right here, Zach, damn, I really hope you're not watching. Um, I got him, I got her assigned it to Zach, Satan's soul as Mira Jane. So this is for my friend. Um, as much, see, I, I was originally going to give him this volume 14. This was going to be my present to him. But I decided I wanted it. So when I went and got back in line, I actually had her sign this to Zach. So I couldn't keep it. Even if I wanted to, it's not written out to me. So... Yeah. Oh, I want it so bad. <laughs> but yeah, I love Monica Rial. She was so... They, all the voice actors were so nice. Like, Monica Rial, I believe she just, like, celebrated her 40th birthday not too long ago. I swear, she's gonna be, like, 25. It was unreal uh, how young she looks. But anyway, I digress. So anyway, guys, I really hope you enjoyed this video. One, that's one thing I love to do at cons is to go and get some stuff signed because it's one of my absolute favorite things to do. Uh, I love meeting voice actors and stuff like that. So uh, if you guys want to go ahead and enjoy this video uh, and want to see other stuff, I have some more signed stuff. If you would ever like to see like spotlight videos on that stuff as well, go ahead and let me know. And uh, if you'd like this video, leave a like and then go ahead and leave a comment on who, like what voice actors you've met and got like what's your favorite thing you've ever got signed by a voice actor or someone in the anime industry. But anyway, guys, I have been Fatal Fair, and I will see you back on the prowl next time. Bye-bye!